My uncle used to say, if the shoe fits, fix it. After 49 years, Abe Ganim from Maple Shoe Repair is a true expert in his craft. These nails, they pop off like bullets. And I've been bit a few times. 23 years in his current shop, his customers have come to depend on him. You're all set, boss? Yeah. Yeah? You can't replace a good pair of shoes that are comfortable and broken in, but sometimes the soles break, and my man over here is the only guy that can really fix them and make them like new. Abe, like all small business owners, suffered during the pandemic. It just died. It totally died. And there was nobody going out. There was nobody coming. No office work means no need for dress shoes. No parties, no customers, because everybody's working from home. Everybody was working from home. Even the TV celebrities were <laughs> sitting at home, uh, uh, not doing it. We're, they're broadcasting from home. But now, an interesting thing is happening. Business is booming. Maple sure Repair, can I help you? Now I'm starting to see more people with weddings. It's yeah. picking back up again. But why aren't people just going out to the stores and buying a new pair of shoes? Abe says that is also pandemic related. I don't go to the mall because I don't like the crowd. So instead of big crowds or attempting to buy something online, he says his customers are opting to just have the old faithfuls fixed. Now this is gonna drive for about a uh, half hour. Once it's dry, I put it on, trim it, and we'll be good to go. While I visited, I began picking up on a theme in the shop. This one right here is an Italian stitcher. This machine was made during World War I, and it is still going to this day. Just because it's old doesn't mean it's garbage. The old saying is, if it fits and it works and it's good, fix it. Derek Kevra, Fox 2 News.